Okay, as you see right now, I have the two HyperX Furies. These are 1866s. This is 16 gigabytes of dual channel that I'm pulling out. And that one's out. We'll try to get this one out. I am a little worried because, like I said, as you can see, the CPU cooler with the width of this is pretty large. You pull the plastic. There's some plastic coverings on these, I just noticed. So we pull, pull those off first. And we'll try to stick this in here. There's one. There's two. There's three. And all four in. It slightly blocks my CPU fan. I will try to move the camera so you can see it. If you see about a quarter of an inch, I will figure out that later. It may not be a big deal as long as the fan does not hit the RAM. I don't see it being a problem right now. So I will set the lights off and try to light this up so you guys can see that in a second. As you can see, it's lit up. My build is a blue and white case, so it's a fractal define R4. I do have blue LED fans, but as you can see, the top of the Evixir is lighting up awesome. I will try to get some close-up video of it. Oh, there we go. If you look, it looks like lightning bolts. It's actually quite exquisite. I love it. I will test it out, play with it. I will give you my feedback later on in the video. But for now, as you can see, it's in there. It's fine. The fan does not rub. So I don't see it being a problem because I have at least, I think, uh, five or six more fans in the case. So we should be good. 